Hello, hello, welcome. Welcome to We Care Support. We are your ministry support team. We are here once again to pray for you. We wanted to welcome you today because it is prayer time. And so we want to give you a little time to come in and, you know, get on board so you can agree with us in prayer. And we'll be praying for families. We'll be praying for individuals. We'll be praying for your loved ones and anybody that you know that um, may have COVID or may have recovered from COVID and just may have some still some illnesses or some symptoms going on, or maybe someone who is just ill or sick or in the hospital, and maybe you just need some support and strength. We want to pray for you for whatever you need today. Um, we want to be a blessing to you. We are here and we will be praying for the families on our list. It is not too late for you to get your family member on our list. And whatever the problem is, whatever the issue, it does not have to be a COVID issue. If you need prayer for anything on Thursdays, we are here for you. We're praying for you. We're praying with you. We're agreeing with the word of God so that you and your family will be healed, will be well, and will walk in victory in a successful way. We also want to bless you with um, being able to comment like, share, follow. You know, we want to be able to be a blessing to you uh, during this time or any time that you're going through. So come on, do a watch party. Come on, get in agreement. Come on, we're here, we're here, we're here for you because we care. So um, today we're going to read the list of names that we have. Um, we have, uh, I think, one or two additional names. And we're going to add that to our list, along with the list we already had. So put that in the comment section if there is someone you want us to cover in prayer. Message us. You can message us um, in Messenger, or you can send an email to wecare.ministry at att.net. And we'll get back to you. We will be praying for you. We'll let you know that we got your message and the person that you would like to be prayed for. We have the uh, we have the uh, the Slaughter family. We want to pray for them. They lost loved ones during COVID, the Hastings and the Cook families. We want to pray for military families. Also the Cooper family, the Francis family. We want to pray for Mother Stanley's family, the Capazillo family, also the Murphy family. They've lost someone. The Monroe family, the Tyler family. We want to pray for anyone and everyone that has family members that may need prayer. If you have a family member, if you have someone that would like to, uh, <laughs> that would like to, I don't know if it's, oh, okay, okay. okay. I thought I was having some technical difficulties. Let me see. All right, so the ladies on the line are unmuted and they are going to pray. We have Kim Tyler today um, and she's gonna lead us in prayer today. So like I said, it's not too late. If you would like for us to pray for you and one of your family members, please send us your information. All right, Kim. Amen. Good evening, everyone. If you would just bow your heads and just give God the glory and the praise as we go into prayer today. Father God, we come to you first, God, just to say thank you, God. Thank you for We Care Ministry, God. You know what we're here for, Father God. We stand in an agreement, Father God, praying for your people, God. Thank you, Father God, for giving my sisters a vision for this ministry, Father God. Father God, your word said, in everything, give thanks. So, God, we say thank you. Thank you for being God all by yourself first, God. Father, with you, nothing is impossible. You are God, the flesh of all. We love you, Father God, and we're confident that no situation is too hard for you. So we're seeking healing in their bodies, Father God, especially those that are going through this virus, Father God, and cancer, Father God. Father God, you know them all, Father God, so we don't have to 
call every name because you're walking in every hospital room, Father God. Any place, Father God, where these people have to be placed right now, those that are going through quarantine that have this virus, Father God, take care of them, Father God. Take them off the ventilators, Father God. Mm -hmm. Send them back home to their families, Father God. Mm -hmm. Father God, we love you, Father God. Father God, we also pray for the families that are grieving, Father God, for the loss of someone that they love, Father God. Lord, heal the hurting. Give them strength to go on, God. Mm -hmm. Be with the children that have lost their parents, God. Heal mm -hmm. their broken little lives and hearts, mm -hmm. Father God. Provide love and nurture to those that are going through, Father God. May the Holy Spirit speak to the parents that have lost their children, Father God. Father God, I thank you for the loss that I've experienced, Father God. For I know that you've never left me nor forsaken me, Father God. You are Jehovah Jireh, my provider, Father God. Now, God, hear the cries of your people, Father God. We give you their names, Father God, and we know that you're going to do it, Father God. Heal them like no at night. Never before, Father God. Bring them back, Father God. And Father God, if it's your decision to take them home, Father God, let them live with you, Father God. Let their souls be saved, Father God. And Father God, those that are getting lost right now, Father God, through this pandemic, Father God, bring them back to you, God. Bring them back to you, God. Call on their names, Father God. Let them know that without you, nothing can happen, Father God. Father God, we lay this prayer list at your feet, God. And we trust you, Father God. Our, our hope is in you, Father God. Father God, let us not grow weary, Father God. Let us not grow weary and get crazy, Father God. Father God, encourage your people to keep going, Father God, and trust in you. Have faith in you. Say just a little faith, Father God. Faith as much as a mustard seed, Father God. And Father God, I have that crazy faith, and I know you're going to do all that you said you're going to do, Father God. Father God, I trust you. We trust you, Father God. And we lay this at your feet, knowing that it's going to be done. Yes. This is my prayer in Jesus' name. More of you and less of me. I pray today. Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. So we hope you will be able to um, join us the next time. And we appreciate you for joining us on today. We thank you that um, every prayer, we believe, we believe by faith that every prayer that was rendered on today, that every name lifted up before our God on today will be answered. For we know that he hears us when we pray. And we believe that he will answer while we're speaking. So on the we care ministry support discussion you will not want to miss it it will be september the 12th at four o'clock p.m central standard time on facebook live yes we're having a wonderful discussion on cancer we're starting our cancer series on on in the month of september so we are here for you, and we want you to know that we are still available for one-on-one -on -one, uh, meetings, Zoom meetings, if you would like. Or you can send us an email or instant message us, message us on Facebook. My tongue tied on today. But to God be the glory. You can email us at wecare.ministry at att.net. And we will be praying for you and your family every Thursday at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. So submit your prayer requests. Please let us pray for you. Prayer is so essential during this time. And we don't want to miss God at any moment. Everything that he's doing, we want to be in we want you to be healed. We want you to be delivered. We want you to be set free. So don't forget to like, share, and follow us on Facebook. We are so excited about what God is doing in your life. And thank you. And remember that the We Care Ministry support team is here helping you to navigate through. So tell your friends and your family and your loved ones about We Care Ministry Support Team. Until next time. God bless you.